Okay, the easiest part of the demo, of course, is when they take the robot for a test drive. When they actually take off and uh, start cleaning things. You, you've stood next to them, you've helped them learn how to use the extension, uh, you've built rapport with them. Uh, they're excited about getting a chance to use this. If there's a husband and a wife, I would generally ask the husband first if he wouldn't mind taking it for a test drive. And then we'll let him say, well, I never I never vacuum. It's my wife that does it. See, that, that's better because sometimes the husband goes, sure, I'm, you know, this is a gadget. This is a toy. And, and, they, and they take off and go. So always ask the husband first if he'd like to test drive it. And let him ask the wife if uh, she would like to do it instead. Because if you just go straight to the wife, you're kind of assuming that, you know, women do the cleaning. We don't really want that. We go straight to the husband. So uh, we ask them to do a test drive. We show them how to use it. And what we do is we do this. This is how I do it. I sit back in my chair after they've started going, cross my legs, and I go, have fun. <laughs> That's it. I pretty much kick back and say, have fun. And then I start giving directions. I say, uh, no, okay, now, get under the table. Isn't that cool? Oh, look, why don't you just go ahead and, and, and go under those chairs over there, and uh, you going to do the hall? We got plenty of cord. Go do the Yeah, just pull the unit with the hose. Just pull it because it's built to be pulled right around your house. It's, it's kind of like your robot, so you tell it what to do and, uh, and have fun. And away they go. And I let them clean as long and as much as they want. Because the longer they clean, the dirtier the water gets. So, uh, I kick back like this, like I'm relaxed. Now, as soon as they get out of view, as soon as they get out of view, I start cleaning. I start wrapping the, the wire of the lamp. And I start wrapping it right on the chrome here. And I start just getting it all nice and neat. See that? I start getting it all nice and neat. And I wrap it all the way up, and I set it down in a nice, neat spot. I take any cloths that are around, running around here, and I make them nice and neat, and I put them in a single spot. Because I want, when the customer comes back from using the unit, I want them to see that same scene that we showed in Section 1, in the setup. And so I'm constantly looking for, for the cords, for the hose. Any mess that I've made, I'm cleaning it up. Because what I want is when the customer comes back, I'm going to just grab the unit and I'm going to take my, my power nozzle and my unit and I'm just going to sit it down right next to us and we're going to be done. And when it's time for referrals, they look around and they see, wow, it's just, that was easy. It's just, you know, the robot and the dirty water and that's it. So it's very important when you're, when your customer is test driving, I like the word test drive, when your customer is test driving the unit, you want to be cleaning up, straightening up, getting the environment nice because the two things that you want to happen during a demo is you want the customer to think that it is easy and it's clutter free. Okay? So that's what's happening. I don't need to show you how to demonstrate the robot because I know that you have used the robot and you've already cleaned your house and you've already done all kinds of things with it. So uh, this is the, uh, the final part I'm going to share with you one more thing about the uh, the kind of last transitional statement. But this, you just let them do their work. And then at the end of that, you're going to bring them back, pop the unit off, shine the light on the side of it so it doesn't bright shine in anyone's eyes, and you let them see dirty, 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 grody, wet hair and gunk water. And you got to look at it like, huh, that's... Isn't that cool? Yeah, you got all that stuff out there. I'm sure it's going to get better every time you use it. So uh, now we're going to move on to the next section.